they were out on uh, on the launch pad 39A. We uh, we had a conversation about why he got involved in this to begin with, and it was to inspire America to increase NASA's budget because of the return we get on those activities. Now, it is true, you know, the idea that we can put humans on another world for long periods of time is great, but the benefits humanity has received from space exploration in general is immeasurable. The return on investment we get from that as a nation and, in fact, as a world, the way we communicate, all of these cameras, direct TV, dish network, internet broadband from space, I see a lot of people here that are going to put this on the internet. We talk about um, XM radio, for example, but the way we communicate, the way we navigate, the way we produce food. I was recently at the Ag Expo, and you know we're sensing the Earth in every part of the mag electromagnetic spectrum, and because of that, we can increase crop yields, we can reduce water usage. At the same time, we can preserve nitrates in the soil, feeding more of the world than ever before because of what NASA does. That's an amazing capability. And we didn't develop the satellites for that purpose. But because we have that data, we can share it, not only with the United States farmers, but around the world. We, we saved tens of millions of dollars in disaster relief that would have gone to Uganda, but be, because we were able to predict ahead of time uh, a disaster situation developing, we could mitigate and save not only money for us in, in the form of aid, but also lives in Uganda. But the way we produce food, the way we understand weather, the way we understand climate, the way we do you know, national security and disaster relief, all of these things were born, and I understand a lot of it's commercialized, and we're, we love that. Help save our, us money at NASA. But a lot of it's commercialized. A lot of it has, is, is done by the Department of Defense. But at the end of the day, it's born from this little agency that occupies less than one half of 1% of the federal budget, and the return on that has been astonishing. So the idea that this event today was was born from a concept of how do we how do we encourage Americans to increase the NASA budget? Um, mm -hmm. Friends, we have that opportunity right now, and, and it is in fact happening uh, with bipartisan support in Congress and support from the administration. So we're we're at a great time. Um, today's event was was amazing to watch, and over the next five days, we're going to see a lot more milestones be achieved, and certainly as an agency and as a country. And really, as a world, with our international partners, we're going to be able to do more than ever before. So I just want to thank everybody with the TV cameras and the, and the iPhones. Get this message to the world. It's an important message. And I'm so grateful for all of you being here and covering this very important achievement in American history.